Hey there, my name's Shara. <laughs> my name's Shara. Okay, my name's Sarah, and I'm gonna be sharing with you what's in my work bag, as well as a mini review of the Fossil Rachel Tote in Bright Multi. It's a canvas has two straps, the classic key to outside pockets, as well as a top zip here, which keeps all your stuff safe and dry. It has two pockets here for your phone and whatever else you need, as well as one inside zip pocket and is a flat bottom, is structured and isn't slouchy so that when you're grabbing for stuff, it's not like never ending Mary Poppins bag. Everything is very accessible, which was one issue I was having with my other Kipling tote bag. It just would slouch and all the stuff would get crushed inside and I wouldn't be able to find anything. On the first outside pocket, I have a comb combo mirror that's purpley and sparkly that I've had for years. A free measuring tape, some floss. This is my favorite kind. It's the Oral-B Essential Floss. It uh, doesn't hurt my gums, especially if you have a brace behind your teeth. I haven't used this yet, but I feel like it's just one of those things that will come in handy. Just a, a couple of mini tools and a receipt from Walmart. I have this little notes pad for meetings or whenever I just wanna jot something down. And going inside the phone pocket, of course, I've got my phone parking pass. Inside the zip pocket, I have my work pass keys with a Henry's camera lens cleaner, which is very useful for cleaning your glasses and you don't really need a spray for it either. Business card from someone. And then in the main section, I have my prescription sunglasses, which have been in every one of my what's in my purse or bag videos along with my regular prescription glasses in purple and green. Ooh, this is really useful. This I got from Topshop from Paper Chase and it's this cotton candy cloud reusable bag. This is kind of like my essentials little bag with pads, disinfectants, pills for headaches. This is my disinfectant from Bath and Body Works in a lemon one. It kind of like has come off the label there. A really beat up hand moisturizer, Crabtree, Evelyn, La Source Ultra Moisturizing Hand Therapy. Let's see, I've got um, some lozenges. Ooh, a lot of mints in here. These ones are the lifesaver ones. I love those ones. And this is a Me To We tea infused lip butter from David's Tea. I love these lip balms. They're like the perfect shape for your lips. They're not completely round. They're more of like a long oval. Hair tie, file, little woven cross really beat up Bosha clear complexion blotting linens that I'm pretty sure if they've expired, they have expired. I unfortunately didn't use those. They were a good idea. Ooh, this is kind of gross. It's picked up a lot of yucky stuff, but this is basically little tooth pick things that are kind of rubbery that I need to refill. I've got a bobby pin and I also like to keep a pair of earbuds on hand. Another bobby pin, a little roots purse for change and gift cards as well as this hard case for all my ID and cards and things like that. Water bottle from Rubbermaid, probably got it from Walmart in pink. It fits perfectly in this bag. That's everything in my work bag that I feel like is important for me and that you might want to consider to have in your own work bag. And I would highly recommend that tote. I feel like it solved a lot of my problems that might be yours as well. I'll leave a link in the description below if you want to check out that bag and all of its stats, like the size. They have other Rachel totes with other patterns if you're not interested in that pattern. I'd love to hear from you in the comments so definitely say hi and ask me questions if you have any for me or suggestions for future videos. I'd love to hear from you. Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked and subscribe if you want to see more of the videos that I make. Make sure to click that bell icon if you want to be notified as soon as I upload. I'd really appreciate it. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you later. Bye.